Certified most accurate. Now your first worn five forecast. Good Monday morning. I'm meteorologist Matthew Mondro with your first worn five update. Now so far this Monday we have had some showers moving into the area from the west. Those are just more scattered in nature and by the afternoon today actually expecting some drier weather, but we are looking more at the bigger picture here, especially towards Wednesday. We have a system over towards the plains that'll be making its way into our area once we head into Tuesday night and Wednesday, bringing some widespread rainfall and that does bring some larger changes to the forecast as well. But for this morning, first those showers farther up north North, mainly to the north and west of the Tri Cities. Midland has been seeing some of that rainfall, but if you're down towards Flint and the Thumb, expecting you to stay mostly dry, if not completely dry, through this morning. There's noon today, especially into the afternoon, all dry at that point. A few clouds do move back in for the evening, so we're looking mostly cloudy there, but no rainfall associated with those clouds. And that'll still be the case for your Tuesday morning, too, as you're heading out the door, not expecting any rainfall, but still be, should be more of a partly to mostly cloudy start on your Tuesday. But here we are once we head into Tuesday night and Wednesday with that system moving in more widespread by Tuesday night and through the daytime on Wednesday. That's that rainfall even all the way through around 3 to 4 p.m. on Wednesday. I wouldn't expect to see dry conditions making a return from that until Wednesday night, but then especially in the Thursday, Friday, we're expecting more dry weather and some brighter skies by then too. Now for this Monday worth noting, still going to be warm just like the weekend, right around 75 degrees, lower 70s into the thumb, and we do have upper 60s on that immediate shoreline of Lake Huron. That water is really starting to cool off a lot of water temps down into the 50s, even some 40s in the Saginaw Bay too, but also holding some of that southerly breeze from the weekend sustained around 10 to 15 miles per hour, but some gusts also up to around 25 miles per hour this afternoon. 70 forecast does have more 70s for your Tuesday, and once that system moves in, so along with the rainfall, it really cools us off too. So that's the big change in the forecast down to 55 and dropping through Wednesday, 52 on Thursday, 56 Friday and still holding more 50s pretty consistently into the weekend. Stay with WNEM TV5 on air, on the go, and online for more news and weather updates.